What's up family, Strat here from Strategic Audio. Got a new video today where I'm going over an example of how to get an authentic sound for your soulful boom bap beats. Now you heard the sample preview so you know we're dealing with that old school boom bap style. A little bit aggressive but still soulful. Boom bap is an interesting niche to work in these days as the sound of hip hop has expanded so much and we have more trap oriented styles being popular. Don't get it twisted though, boom bap is still alive and I think always will be. It's the very foundation that modern hip hop stands on and it has evolved as well. You got old school styles, modern styles, melodic styles, soulful styles, dark styles and even fusions with other subgenres. Not to mention the biggest current artists in hip hop like Cole and Kendrick and the enduring veterans like Jigga and Nas all still make boom bap styles as part of their catalogs. Anyway, let's get into the sample which by the way is available for free at the first link in the description. Please drop a like and subscribe if you're willing and able just to show your support and here we go. First up is a simple piano chord progression in C minor. Of course I use piano tech 8 and my go to effects of simple EQ, compression, reverb and some RC20 to give it a little bit of lo-fi energy. As you know my philosophy is not to overdo the effects, EQ, reverb, compression are generally the things that I use on all of the melodies uh, from time to time I will use an RC20 or maybe a Cymatics Origin, uh, delay where necessary but I like my stuff to sound fairly organic and um, so I won't really need to be going over each EQ that I use in each compression that I use because I'll just be repeating myself. So here's what that piano sounds like. It's best in my opinion for this style to keep the chord movement simple and even maybe repetitive. See this style of hip hop is not always known for its intricate musicality. It's characterized by a lot of chopped up soul samples and rugged drums. Something simple but still interesting to inspire the MCs to really flow and spit some amazing bars. So for this, the chords move from C minor 7 to F minor 7. That repeats again here and then ends off on a G sharp major 7. Obviously I didn't just play the chords in a sustained style, I basically just freestyled what felt like an interesting melody within the chords. So for the next instrument I added a simple violin section. It sounds a little bit like a string quartet and it just follows the same progression as the piano. If you notice here the C minor 7 chord in each case isn't played as a straight sustained chord, it has kind of a build up where some of the notes don't come in at the very beginning, uh, it's just, it was just the style choice, there is really no need for you to do that but I think it makes it more interesting. Now let's move on to the bass. This is a preset I created in Serum. There's tons of tutorials online showing how to create all sorts of sounds in Serum so feel free to check those out. I went for a simple style that was a mix of sustained and staccato notes. For this type of sample, I think you need something that follows the root notes, has a bit of variation to it and adds some energy. Next up we have this driven lead guitar sound that I use Omnisphere for. Now here I didn't just follow the root notes. It starts on the root and then goes to the seventh, then the root and then the seventh and then ends on the seventh again. I think it's way more interesting to the ear to add harmonic texture in this way than it is to just keep layering root notes over and over and over again. Okay so now just as a background layer I played the main chords again with a Rhodes electric piano sound in a sustained style.
Now as a small counter melody, I added this acoustic grand piano in a high octave. It adds a nice accent and you can keep these types of tracks a bit lower in the mix. You really don't want them to take too much focus away from the main groove. Finally, for this last track, I added a minor saxophone accent. This is very reminiscent of lots of old school boom bap beats. Of course, I had to add this simple delay for that authentic old school vibe. Alright, so that was all the individual melodic parts. Let's hear everything together. Now, let's add some dusty, old, rugged drums to it. Alright, so thank you so much for watching. It means a whole lot to me, especially if you watched all the way through, click the like button or subscribe. Don't forget, you can download this sample along with the stems and the MIDI at the first link in the description. Drums not included though. Also, I've got two other free full loop kits available down there as well. Each has eight full classic soul compositions along with stems and MIDI. So, download and enjoy and I'll see you in the next video.